We take our lines Evelyn Taft to sharing some tips on how to survive this economy during the holidays by going homemade. Today she's going to show us some guilt-free truffles. We're here with Liz Alexanian, and she's the owner of Cook LA, and she's going to teach us how to make a really fun handmade holiday treat. Of course, it's going to be edible, and it's guilt-free. It's guilt-free chocolate truffles. Yes. So we're going to go ahead and put in a cup and a half of walnuts. Okay. So okay. go ahead and put that in your the food processor. Now put in a dash of salt and grind everything together. So the next thing that we're going to add to our recipe mm -hmm. is our... Um, unsweetened cocoa powder. Okay. Okay, so that's a third of a cup already pre-measured, so go ahead and pour that in for us. Throw in our medjool dates. Make sure to soak them in water for at least 20 minutes. They'll not only act as our sweetener, but they'll also give us a serving of potassium and fiber. All right, we're going to put in a half tablespoon of pure vanilla extract. And the next item that we're going to go ahead and add to our recipe is our organic agave nectar. I love agave. Yes. I sweeten everything with agave. Wonderful. It's mixing in there. It's right? mixing. Once you're done mixing, put the ingredients in a bowl. We're going to wet our hands a little bit. Okay. So go ahead and wet your hands so it doesn't, the mixture doesn't stick. Okay. We're going to grab about, again, half a tablespoon. Okay. So go ahead and let me give this to you. Okay. We're going to make a round little ball from it. Okay. And we have three flavors that we can dip it in. Ooh. And the more you have, the better it looks okay. on a plate. Very easy. So I'm going to go ahead and pick the uh, unsweetened cocoa powder to roll this in. Okay. So we have a mixture of shredded coconuts. Oh, yum. And we have a mixture of walnuts, sugar, and some cinnamon for okay. the holidays. Are absolutely gorgeous. Can't wait to try it. Wonderful. But of course, if you do want to make it as a gift, mm -hmm. you've got options. Yes. Right? Here you go. Definitely, you can put it in a box, mm -hmm. put a bow on it, okay. put a nice little card in the front. Okay. It's very homemade, very easy to make, I love it. and you didn't take too much time to make it. So here's the part we've all been waiting for. We want to try it. Okay. I know I've been very excited, so let's give it a shot. Cheers! Mmm. Okay, that's good. So now it's your turn to do it at home. <laughs> And for more information on Chef Liz and Cook LA, just go to our website, kkl9.com. Click on Scene on TV. Coming up next, we